Alpha Mind Power online live classes by Sri Mata Vijay Lakshmi Pandayan. Mobile app Alpha Mind Power. Namaste. In another video of mine earlier, I had spoken about uh, is there somebody who is uh, creating a problem in your life or creating tension in your mind. I had spoken under that heading and I had also spoken about uh, how you can uh, create changes in your mind and remove your mind from that anxiety, from that tension. I had spoken on that. And so many uh, people had uh, written their comments for that video, both in Tamil and in English. So many comments were there. People had written about their own lives, how somebody was creating a, a disturbance in their mind. After seeing all those comments, uh, I read each and every one of those uh, comments which were there in, uh, below the video. I really thought that though I had uh, spoken about this disturbance which is caused by some person, sometimes you just get perturbed just by the presence of a person in your life or you get a lot, you feel a lot of fear or sometimes it is anger, something you become disturbed. So I had spoken about this and I had spoken more about how you can change your mind and make sure that you are not affected by that person. But at the same time, it would be so good if you could do something to pacify that person so that that person's energy changes, that person's mind also changes and uh, there is no longer uh, so much negativity coming from that person. So that would also really help. And when I thought about this, uh, I was reminded of uh, something which happened about 20 years back, I think, one, uh, yeah, more than 20 years back, just when I had started uh, Alpha Mind Power classes. One lady came to meet me, a young lady, she was about 22 or 23. And uh, as soon as she came, uh, she said, uh, I have continuous headache. I, I wake up in the morning with a headache. And uh, in the night also, I go to sleep with the headache only. And throughout the day, I do all my work with the headache. Then I asked her, did you consult any medical doctors? Did you take any medicine? She said, yes, I went and met uh, a few doctors and took some medication. I even checked my eyesight. She said, everything is normal. And finally, the doctors have told me that now I have to only look at my mind. There is something wrong with my mind. So that's why I've come to you, she said. Then I said, okay, so do you have any problem in your life? Then uh, she said she has been married for two years and she had not conceived because uh, there was some problem. She and her husband had gone uh, for a checkup and the doctor told them that her husband has a slight problem, but uh, still they, she can conceive and they should just be a little patient. But they had not uh, conveyed this to the elders in the family. So she said, my mother-in-law, believes that uh, I am unable to conceive even though it is two years since we got married she thinks I am not uh, fit to conceive so she wants to find another girl and get her married to my husband she wants to conduct a second marriage for him so that is what is causing a lot of tension in my mind she says my husband is very good we are both very happy but my mother-in-law stays in the neighboring street so she comes home every day and she starts uh, speaking about this topic and she says, I'm definitely going to find a girl and I'll see that he gets married. I'll see that I have grandchildren. All this is causing a lot of tension. I'm afraid I might lose my life. But her husband keeps assuring and he says, I will not marry anybody. But she says, but still, there is so much pressure coming from my mother-in-law. So that is making me panic. And the headache could be because of that. Then uh, I told her uh, to attend our alpha class. At that time, she was able to attend. So she attended and she learned many things. But I also guided her even before the class. I told her, see, every day you just go into a meditative state and uh, think of your mother-in-law. In her case, it was the mother-in-law because you can also do this for whoever you want. So that's why I'm sharing it here. I said, think of your mother-in-law and from the cosmic energy, ask for white light to shower upon her. White light has this uh, quality of dissolving negativities. You do not even have to think, analyze or think about it because we have been seeing a lot of results in the last 20 years. So just use it and see the, the result for yourself. The white light, just visualize it flowing on this lady. That will remove the negative thoughts, negative energies from her. And after that, give her a shower of pink color. Pink is a color of love. Let her feel a lot of love towards you, a lot of pink color. And then finally, I told this lady, you see your mother-in-law smiling at you and talking to you nicely. Just keep doing this every day. And uh, she started doing this. Of course, in between, she attended our class. So she learned the technique even more, uh, you know, properly. And she started practicing. 
After a month or so, she visited me to, and uh, she wanted to give me a follow. Then I said, what happened? How was your headache? She said, her headache has disappeared and I'm very happy now. She said, I have a different kind of problem. I said, what? She says, now my mother-in-law comes home every day in the morning and then she's showering me with love and affection. She says, why are you doing all this? Why are you doing so much work? Shall I cook for you? Shall I wash your clothes for you? Shall I do this? So that has become a problem now. She's all the time there and she's wanting to help me. So she was saying this in a joking manner. But the point is her mother-in-law had changed completely. And this thought of finding another girl and conducting a second marriage for her son had completely vanished from her mind. And she was very loving and very affectionate and kind to this girl. So the problem was solved completely. So you can also practice this if there is somebody in your life who's irritating you, who's frustrating you, who's disturbing your mind. And you know meditation, at a meditative state you can do this. But in case you do not know meditation, then also you can practice. Very simple, sit down and close your eyes. Mentally connect with whichever God you pray to. And start taking simple deep breaths. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Just do this 10 times, 15 times, 20 times. Slowly you will find yourself becoming very calm. That is also equal to a meditative state. At that state, you can think of this person, shower white color, shower pink color, and then see that person smiling at you. That is more than enough. Keep doing it every day and you become calm and you will slowly start seeing the changes happening there and that can change your life also. It can make your life much better. So just try it and see. It's very simple.